Today, the community came together to honor the life and legacy of Colonel Carol Bobko at the Air Force Academy. Colonel Bobko graduated from the Academy and eventually became the Academy's first ever NASA astronaut. Cardio News Channel 13's Carolyn Felling attended that service today at the Academy and is live in our newsroom to explain how his family and friends are remembering him tonight. Carolyn. Today, friends and family gather at the Academy for the burial to honor the service and commitment to, the country, to his country. Bobco is the first of 40 astronauts to graduate from the Air Force Academy. So it was really a, a lifelong friendship. Colonel Max Miller lived with Boko during their four years at school. He was my smartest roommate, my uh, roommate with the greatest sense of humor, and I always loved being with Bo. Ten years after graduation, he became a NASA astronaut. Boko joined the first voyage on the shuttle Challenger in 1983, commencing an era of space exploration that captivated the world. In 1985, he went to space again, launching from the Kennedy Center in April of 1985 as a mission commander to deploy communication satellites. And so one of the things that was so amazing about Bo was that he certainly had a vision and he had the commitment both to the Air Force and to NASA and to the country and to his family. Boko was recognized with three NASA Space Flight Medals, two Exceptional Service Medals, and six Johnson Space Center Awards during his career. I guess you could say that most of us thought Bo was going to do, maybe not guess how well he did, but that he was going to do well. He's the only astronaut to have flown on the maiden flight of the two space shuttles outside of his incredible space center. Boko's sister-in-law says he was a family man. He and his wife of 62 years raised a son and daughter together. Family has been such a solid piece of his life. I, I think that gave him the courage and the support to be able to do all the things that he did. His loved ones asked to remember Boko for his remarkable journey and the mark he left on these halls in space. He leaves a legacy to always reach for the stars. He just, he had the vision, he had the intelligence, he had the hard work commitment that, that made his life what it was. Colonel Bob Coe's final resting place is at the Air Force Academy Cemetery. Reporting live in the newsroom, Carolyn Felling, KRDO, News Channel 13.